Hello, I'm Patrick at Roof Life of Oregon. As I look at these shake roofs in Portland for the last 34 years, what I have found is the first growth that likes to establish itself on a roof is the black fungus. So when you get a new roof, it's that beautiful tawny brown color of cedar. And then by a year, it's gone to a light ash gray or silver gray color. And then after about two or three years, it starts getting little black circles and then all the circles connect together and now your roof is black and it's interesting because it happens over two to three to four year period of time the homeowner kind of just embraces it as normal but boy as soon as we clean it or we apply our product and it cleans the roof they're going wow i i have forgotten how beautiful a shake roof can be because you know what happens when a roof is black you lose all the definition, you lose all the shadow line, you lose all the character of your roof. It just looks like a black blank up there. And so <clears throat> when you get up on the roof and you're looking at the roof for its well care, what I've noticed is that a black fungus is about a sixteenth of an inch of growth and it's covering every square inch of your cedar. And when the sun comes out, it superheats the shakes. We've done studies that show that at that black fungus, as compared to a clean light ash gray roof, actually is 18 degrees more heat. Every 17 degrees of heat over 88 degrees is two times the degradation just because of the color of the roof. So it's a big deal. People don't realize that because I'm letting my roof stay black, it's causing my roof to degradate two times faster. The other thing that I found out is that when the black fungus is on there. I think it's like a baby receiving blanket. It's that really soft, thin cotton that if you've ever done the laundry, you know when that blanket's wet, it just wraps around your hand and it just coats the whole shake. And when the when it rains, it sits there and holds that moisture on there for days on end, as opposed to when the shake's clean, when it rains, it just wicks off. So you have a dry roof in an hour, or a dry roof in two days. Retained moisture on wood pulls the natural binding resins out of the wood and this causes them to decay quicker. Because of the products that we use on the cedar shakes, it allows the wood to be heat and light reflective, which cuts down on that degradation process. And also it allows the wood to stay cool because a black roof is a lot hotter than a uh, light ash gray roof. When the rains come, we might get a rainstorm and then we might not get something for four or five days and then another rainstorm. A clean roof with no growth on it wicks off the water and stays dry in between those rainstorms. But a black covered roof with black fungus, it'll stay wet the whole time between the rainstorms, therefore causing degradation to happen twice as fast. So well care maintenance has your roof last twice as long and look good during the whole time.